Hey racers, John Racer 3 here today, back for another Hot Wheels tournament. As you can see, we have approximately 24 drag cars here, about to take on the drag strip. As you can see, we have the Super 6 lane here, set up with the electronic timing there. Almost dropped my phone. We have our electronic timing all set up, and we're going to find out which one of these drag cars is the fastest. Let's start off with the first match. First mass up, match up is a Hot Wheels Mustang versus a Pro Stock Camaro. Our lights are green for the drag. In three, two, one. And it looks like it's going to be the Mustang winning that one and is going to move on to the next round. As you can see here by the order of these cars, we have most of the cars have only three of their kind as you can see. Pro Stock Commandos are three, the Bel Airs are three, the Toon Daytonas are three. So what this, how this is going to work is normal tournament style, but if there's 12, well, there's obviously going to be three finalists. Well, if two of the finalists are the same manufacturer, we'll battle them against each other. But if all three finalists are different manufacturers, then we're going to have to go to a shootout to see who can get the fastest time. Let's continue our drag race. So you can see we have our first lane stage and the Pro Stock Camaro is also staged the lights are green who will take the second round between the pro stock camaro and the hot wheels mustang three two one this time it looks like the pro stock camaro is gonna take that one it looks like ford put in one of their other drag cars because the hot wheels mustang ran out of production by that i mean i don't have any more so this is the next car for ford about about to go up against the pro stock camaro three two one And that Mustang is fast. Ford is going to best Chevy in this race. In our next set of matchups, we have a lot of engine. We have the Chevy Bel Air and the tuned Dodge Daytona. This is going to be interesting to see. Both have shining engines. Both are very fast. Three, two, one. And it looks like the Dodge is going to take it, knocking the Bel Air off and take it. The win. Here we go is our next race. We have the Bel Air and the Daytona again. Three, two, one. It looks like the Bel Air is gonna absolutely destroy here. Bel Air takes the win. And in our final matchup of the Bel Air versus the Dodge, we have the red. It looks like K-Day Bel Air versus the purple Dodge. Three, two, one. It's a close battle between the two, but it is gonna be the Dodge. In the end, taking the win. Here we go, we've got our next set of six matchups, and now we're starting to get into the actual Plymouths, Superbirds, and the Daytonas. We have a Plymouth Superbird here going up against the Ford Mustang. Let's see who takes it in three, two, one. It's a close race between the two, but it's gonna be the Superbird taking the win. Looks like we've got a super treasure hunt here, ready to watch the race. Round two of Plymouth versus Mustang. Three, two, one. It's a really close one this time, but it looks like the Mustang is gonna beat the Plymouth. This is some very, very close casting. Now we've got some Plymouth versus Daytona races. The Plymouths, well, say Plymouth on the side, and Daytonas don't. So that's how you tell them apart. This Plymouth, in particular, is faster than ever. Can it beat the Daytona? We'll have to find out in three, two, one. And it looks like the Plymouth is going to best the Daytona in this race. We've got another green Daytona about to hit the track this time. The Plymouth is sort of a burnt orange color. Can the Plymouth continue its reign over the Daytona? We'll find out in three, two, one. Look at that Plymouth go! Absolutely destroys it. And moves on to the next round. Three out of the four Plymouths have moved on. None of the Daytonas have moved on. We have two more Daytonas left. They're going up against some 32 Fords. Can the Daytonas redeem themselves? We'll have to find out. Three, two, one. It's a close race between these two cars. It's going to come down to the millisecond. And it is going to be the Daytona beating out the Ford. Now our final match of the first round, the final Daytona versus the final Ford. Three, two, one. And it looks like the Ford is gonna take this one. Piece of cake. 
I feel like there's no better time to unbox this Super Treasure Hunt. As you can see, we have our Plymouth in front of us, but we also have the Daytona Super as well. So I feel like I'm just going to crack it open for the sake of this tournament and review it. Let's take a look at this thing. I am a huge fan of these cars with the big wings, especially the Plymouth and the Daytona. I think they look absolutely amazing next to each other. And heck, we should probably give them a race. Just for the marvels, we have the Superbird versus Daytona Super Treasure Hunt race. Let's we'll see who wins it in three, two, one. It's gonna be close. None of them even finish. The Daytona gets there first, but he goes backwards. Comment down below. Which car who do you think won? Which one do you think looks better? All right, let's continue this tournament. First round of the second matchup, we have Camaro versus Mustang. Round two, three, two, one. That Mustang is fast. Mustang is gonna move on. All right, here's our next matchup. We have the Toon Daytona versus the Ford Funny Car. Three, two, one. And it's gonna be the Toon Daytona. Taking the win. Here's our next matchup. We have another Toon Daytona versus a Bel Air. Three, two, one. That Bel Air is quick. It's gonna be the Bel Air taking the win. We've got the Plymouth Superbird Mainline versus a Ford Mustang. Three, two, one. It's a close race between the two, and the time states it is the Mustang taking the win. We've got Plymouth versus Plymouth in this next race. Three, two, one. And that burnt orange Superbird is just fast. Our final matchup of the second round, we have Dodge Daytona versus a Ford number 32-4. 32-1. It's a close race, but Ford gives it its best, but it is going to be the Daytona taking the win. We've got our final six cars here. We have a Ford there and a Ford there. We have a Dodge there, a Dodge there, and we have a Chevy and a Plymouth. Who will be the champion? We are about to find out. Here we go, round number one, Mustang versus Daytona. Three, two, one. It's gonna be close, but it is going to be the Mustang just edging out the Daytona. Daytona actually hops a lane. Sorry, sir. You belong in here. Ford claims the first spot in the finale. Here we go, we've got our second round. We've got the Bel Air versus the Mustang. Three, two, one. And it looks like it's gonna be the Bel Air taking the win. Who will go up against the Mustang on the Bel Air? It'll either be the Daytona or the Plymouth Battle of the Superbirds. Three, two, one. And it looks like Plymouth is gonna take this win. We've got our final three cars. We're gonna have to do a time trial. Which car has the fastest time? We've got lane one on. What will the Mustang clock as its time? Three, two, one. A 2.374. Very fast. Now what can the Bel Air do? Three, two, one. A 2.382. Not faster than the Mustang. Alright, the Plymouth has to be a 2.374. Three, two, one. It's a fast run. This is a 2.402, so he's not fast enough to beat the Hot Wheels Mustang, who will be your victor today. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed this tournament. If you want to see more tournaments like this, make sure you like the video and comment down below, and I'll make sure to do more. Well, thank you guys for watching. I appreciate you all. Thank you for watching. I already said that. See you later. Paradigm.